Hello everyone, welcome back and another episode from Life is Strange True Colors. We are starting chapter 4. So just keep up with likes and support, they are greatly appreciated. And if you are new to my channel, please click the subscribe button, I will be very grateful. And let's continue that one, right? Let's go. Chapter 4 Flicker. Clicker? Damn, what is that? Last of Us? Pike, it's all on this USB drive. All the evidence you need to nail Typhon for Gabe's death and plenty more. All right. Bring it with you. I'll meet you in an hour. Thanks. Talk soon. Citizens of Haven Springs, we are live at the Spring Festival. One final reminder to head over to the Lathe Flower Cart and grab a rose before they're gone. At Haven's inaugural Spring Festival, eligible women of good stock and birthing age would offer up roses in order to attract a mate. What can I say? History is weird. Thankfully, we've lost the mating stuff, but kept the roses. And if you do have a special someone in mind, a rose is a great way to say you care. And an even better way to say, hey look, a rose. Sounds fun. Is giving away a rose something I'd do? Maybe. I can decide downstairs. Yeah, give a rose to who? Ryan? For now, I'll grab the USB stick. Okay. Oh, what do we have in here? Something changed? Not really, I guess. Maybe a little bit. For now, I'll grab the USB stick. Yes, okay. You do that. Uh, I mean, we can... Yeah, what can we do much over here? I guess nothing, right? Not much. Boost, we cannot drink. Yeah, look at the window. Oh, what's that? Oh, that seems to be like a memory. Traditionally, you give roses to your crush at the spring festival, so... Rest Rose. I've Trophier. never had a girl give me flowers before. I'm sorry. I didn't know you cared so much about traditional gender roles. I'll get back to my butter churning and doilies. Shut up. You first. Shut up, you first. All right. Uh, Gabe's notebook? I'm about ready to start oh, yeah. my own list. This one, yeah. Uh, let's see, how can we dress? In what? Into what exactly? Oh, what? <laughs> no way. Oh, no. Oh, come on. So, yeah, this or that? I mean, this one? <laughs> come on. Yeah, so let's go. Let's go like that. And let's take that USB stick, right? Um, boy, we have some letter. The world really doesn't deserve Thanor. Oh, from it then, nice. LARP was amazing, yes I know, right? Damn, that was awesome. I like it, just like we did in, uh, in Saints Row, yeah. Saint Row, that was LARPing as well. That was cool. Yeah, let's take that one and. Uh, yeah, we will okay. go. Time to, to head downstairs. Festival? Okay, oh. I thought it would be like a. Like a cat's cutscene or something. Oh, well, right now we are already here, okay. Test, test. Check, check. Check. Check it out. Holy shit, you want a skirt? <laughs> hey, guys. Happy first spring fest. 
Thanks. I got a hold of Pike. He'll be here soon. Once he sees what's on that stick, it's over for Typhon. Hence the celebration. <laughs> I think we've all earned the right to enjoy ourselves a little tonight. The band's coming on soon. You'd better be front and center. Uh, who's playing? Yep. Nice. Who's playing? Local band. You'll love them. I have to run back to the trailer. Go be a normal person for a while. Can't make any promises. Text me when it's ready. A normal person? Oh, come on. If I wanted to give away a rose, Steph and Ryan would definitely be on my list. Anyway, time to enjoy the festival. I am always normal. Oh, what's that? Another memory? Yes, it is. Drugs for makeup from Seattle. We've got um, merch. Dude, count me in. I'm dying. Oh, it will be so nice to ride on that. A microphone. Another memory. Why microphone is behind the stage? <laughs> Hey, hello, everybody? Can I have your attention? Jed, what are you doing? I just wanted to take this opportunity to say, right here, in front of God and everyone, that Annette Teresa Foster is just the most beautiful woman in the world. They say the Spring Festival is about telling folks how you feel. And Anne, I feel like I'd just about die if I couldn't make you my wife. You had to go and make a scene, didn't you? Let's go to... Where? 232. 233. What the hell? 234. No. <sighs> the red one so was 234. Wait. Why do I do this to myself? Damn it. Hmm. Maybe I can <sighs> help him somehow. One. Two. Three. Another year, another prize gift card for yours truly to keep. I'm such a little devil. Really? Come on, jelly bean lady. That's not right. A jelly bean jar? This is impossible. Right? Guess the number of jelly beans win a prize. Oh shit, what the hell? Hi. Oh, hey. Nice to see you. You're taking this jelly bean thing very seriously. Yeah, because the prize is a $100 gift card. Chrissy's been all anxious ever since she got lost. So, I thought I could get her a bunch of treats. Which is really embarrassing, saying it out loud. Not at all. That's sweet. Maybe I can help. Oh, for real? Are you good at this? How many jelly beans do you think there are? Uh, what, 300? 300 ish. Huh. Yeah, could be. Feels like something just changed in that lady by the jar. Oh. Maybe I should read her. Huh, she knows how many there are. 300? What a nitwit. Not even close. I was that far off? Maybe I should say something before he guesses wrong. Also, how is your problem, lady? <laughs> hey, I've got another guess. Yeah? 700. I think it's closer to 700. Yeah, 700 feels right. But we have to get it exactly. Just felt that lady's heart skip a beat. I should Let's read see. her again. Maybe she will say the exact number. Really oh. close to 731. Who is this girl? Hell yes. 
Your secret's mine. 731? Awesome. Let's say. The answer is 731. Don't ask me how. 731 jelly beans. That's... That's correct. <laughs> yes. Gotcha. Thanks so much for your help. Yeah. You rule. No sweat. No problem. Oh, that was cool. What the... Oh, phone. Oh, the jelly bean guessing contest has ended. Congratulations to our winner, Hector. <laughs> yep. A top of beer. Nice. What else do we have Got over some here? Kill. Might as well wander around and be social. Oh, hello, Steph. What are you doing here? Hey, Steph. <laughs> <laughs> She's busy. Whoa. Stop I see things. Where's the after party this year? After party? Come on. Young man like yourself, you must know what the haps is. <laughs> Honestly, I'm getting pretty bushed. Thinking of calling it a night soon. My goodness. What is this town coming to? Used to be that the spring festival wasn't complete till everyone was either asleep in the park or in someone else's bed. It's coming to an end. Must have been pretty wild back in your day. My day? I'm talking about last year. <laughs> wow. God, I just hope Riley is doing all right. Oh no. Oh. What happened to Riley? Where is she? Hi, Eleanor. Good evening, dear. Hey, so where's Riley? I haven't seen her around. Well, she's got a lot going on right now. I think she'd rather keep to herself tonight. Hey. Why? That was odd. I wonder if there's something she's not telling me. So, we doing shots tonight or what? Of course. Body shots? Who's going first? Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> or am I? <laughs> <laughs> oh. She's funny. The decorations really turned out beautifully. It must have been a huge amount of work. It's worth it. I better get going. Yes. Enjoy your night. You too. Is she feeling the same? I guess. I mean... It happened last year. Yep. I remember clearly. It's been a hell of a month. But this makes it all worthwhile. Jed loves this town so much. It's inspiring. Broadcast live from the park. Right? A student. It almost Again? Makes it feel like a tiny coach. This <laughs> is awesome. Tiny. Favorite time of the year. So by far. Listen, man, that kind of enthusiasm is infectious. Especially for me. That song. Alabaster Daydreams? Mm, early 2000s? Maybe? <laughs> anyway, the weirdest thing happened today. I was in the lantern, studying, and I was thinking about the lyrics and wishing it would come on, and then it totally did. Yeah. <gasps> what are the chances? Right? Right? Yeah. It makes you think, doesn't it? About the light. Oh, Mac is here? I heard the call. And I wanted to thank you. I know you tried to do the right thing. So, what now? I'm taking Typhon down, the whole hornet's nest. I'm not betting against you, but 
In the meantime, they're the only ones cutting checks in town. And I still got plenty of bills to pay. Come on, Matt. Even you're too good to work for them. <laughs> it's always flattering to see how much you care about me. No wonder you try to break up me and Riley. Ugh. There's the Mac I know. <laughs> Sounds like Take crying easy, a dude. for me. I better head back. Head back where? No, let's explore. Let's go to the city. No alcohol beyond this point. <laughs> oh, what's that? Okay, so there's this young farm maid in the elvish countryside. Sets out to find her missing sister, who was abducted years ago by a guild of warlocks. Go Thank on. you, Steph. Thanks for helping me find the fun again. Sounds like Ethan wasn't the only one inspired by the LARP today. Ha. <laughs> They find the sister. Looks like plenty of people are still out around town. Ice cream woman? <laughs> well, we gave it a shot. Oh, stop, mister. Couldn't hack it in the ice cream biz after all. But at least we gave it a shot. Sounds like they've reached the end. Of their rocky road. I'm the worst. Responsibility. Sounds if like. We gotta shut down the shop. I want you to know that I. What is there really to explore? I'm not sure. Oh, we can enter bar. Let's go. Sounds like Ryan is ready for me. I should head outside. Jet's crown. <laughs> Flower arrangements. Uh, oh. Polaroid memory. All right. Come on, son. Get it over with. Ah! <laughs> I don't want to get sick. You're going <laughs> to feel a whole lot better after you do. I'm, I'm going to die, Dad. Not tonight, you're not, birthday boy. Although I suspect you're going to wish you had tomorrow morning. <laughs> Attaboy. <laughs> oh. Ducky. Oh. What's up? Oh, he's sad? It's not the same without you, Tabitha. Never was, never will be. Tabitha, sounds like Ducky's got a story to tell. Damn, who's Tabitha? Well, we will uh, maybe try to help him, right? Let's see. Hey, Ducky, who's Tabitha? Do you want to talk about her? You know, Alex, on this particular matter, I don't have much to say. Okay. Okay. Yep. There's got to be more I can do for Ducky. Yeah, now he have strong emotions. Let's go. So we are like in a sea of tears, I guess. Okay. Tell me what I need to know to help him. You know, I carved that myself. Oh, hi, I'm Reginald McAllister III. My friends call me Ducky. <laughs> Tabitha Baker. 
call me Tabs. All right. This thing and oh, there was something a table. And is there anything else? A jukebox. All right. Wait, wait! Don't drink it. Look at the bottom. What? What are you? Uh, oh, Ducky, it's beautiful. Tabitha Baker, will you marry me? Oh boy, she was the love of his life. Happy anniversary, love. Here's to another thirty years. Wow. And another 30 festivals, if we can make it. Ducky, you're gonna outlast this whole damn town. I know that song. Poor Ducky. Maybe there's something I can do. Let's see now what we can do. What are the options? It's a tough night for you, isn't it? The Spring Fest? That's right. Tabitha Spring Festival, wooden beer, dance. Let's dance. Give me one sec. How did you know? <laughs> How did you? They're playing your song. Let's dance. You know what reminds me most of her right now? It's not the song or the festival. It's that you took the time to care about a sad old man for no other reason than to make the world a little less troublesome. That was Tabs. Thank you, Alex. I think I'm a little more inclined to join the others outside. You're very welcome. Enjoy the festival. It's not the same without her, but yeah. Still. Enjoy it. Sounds like Ryan is ready for me. Sounds I like outside. we are doing a lot of good things. Right, we are helping a lot of people. That is so nice. Sounds like Ryan is ready for me. I better head back. Yes, yes, he is. Jesus Christ. Grand opening tomorrow. Free I gotta pull my shit together for, for this grand opening. Attendees. These people won't be so gracious forever. We might. Free food goes a long way in Haven. I'll take a coupon. No coupons, my dear. Just tell me your name and I'll remember it. All right. Alex Chen. Alex Chen? Didn't we speak already tonight? Nope. Oh, stupid. So stupid. Print some coupons, they said. It's a small town, I'll remember, I said. Oh, hubris. <laughs> you know, you could try posting on my block. Whoever comments gets the deal. Oh, well, that's a good idea. Best of luck. Right, that is a good idea, yes.
And who's over here? Are you serious right now? A boot? A fucking One, boot? One, two, three. I control me. So One, two, fuck. I don't control shit. <laughs> Sorry, man. We've all been there. Jesus Christ. One, two, three, I, co I control myself. Oh boy, you are controlling Lots shit. Lots of people still hanging out on Main Street tonight. Really? Where? I can see nobody. Where are they? Oh. The LARP was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was. Do you think there's food left at the festival? Are you God, I still like her so much. What do I do? Sorry, man. Oh, that's it in love. That's the couple from before. It's nice of you. Right. Cool. Damn it. I'm head over heels for this dork. What do I do? Wait, they're both into each other? Come on, people. Yeah, come on, people. What the hell? Hey, um. Cute couple. <laughs> yeah. I just wanted to say, you two make a really cute couple. Uh, oh! <laughs> Thanks, Alex. That's really sweet. That so. idea doesn't bother you? Us being a couple? Yeah. I... kind of like it. <laughs> Holy shit. Well, we are a couple already, right? <laughs> oh boy, what the hell is going on? Okay, Ryan is waiting on me. Yes, he is, but there is some... I have a surprise for you. Good surprise or bad surprise? I didn't expect that him playing my favorite game would be a turn on. But here we are. A romancing melody. The nurse? She's adorable! I'll... Wait, is someone standing out past the Bridge of Flowers? Pretty late for a bus ride. Oh, yeah, there is someone. Who is that? What is that? Another memory. Nana, no, hey, don't put that sticker up. And oh, honey, you'll catch the first few hours. Oh, an and emotional archaeologist. Trophy urn for collecting all Actually, of those Nana, memories. I might just wait at the bus stop. Oh. Avoid the parade of goodbyes. I'll cover for you. Oh shit, so she is standing over there. Oh, let's go then. Wow, like, let's say goodbye to her, right? Or, I don't know, maybe we can tell her to stay. I mean, she's going for a study. Here I am, just waiting at the bus stop. About to change my entire life. I've been there. Hey, Riley. Oh, hi, Alex. What are you doing out here? Just out for a walk. You? <laughs> My bus comes tonight and I just couldn't bear saying goodbye to everyone. I get that. I'm really gonna miss this town. I'll miss my Nana most of all, of course. <laughs> I hope Nana's okay. She's in good health, but sometimes I wonder if I should really be leaving her here alone. Oh, she will not be alone. Eleanor is keeping her condition a secret. But I feel like Riley would want to know. What should I do? Alright, what should I do? Let's... Keep that secret, yeah. Eleanor is so proud of you. All she wants is for you to follow your dreams. You're right, of course. Good luck with everything. We're rooting for you. All right, that was quick. Thanks, Alex. Have a great time at the festival. So, goodbye, Riley. What was that? Yeah, talk to Ryan, right? 
Oh, hey. Just in time. So, who's playing? You. Yours truly. <laughs> I knew Seriously? it. Seriously? That's awesome! Well, wait. Who else? All of you guys? Steph. Who else is playing? I hate you both. <laughs> what the hell? We didn't want you to wuss out. <laughs> I wouldn't. Who said anything about wussing out? Nobody, but only because we didn't give you the opportunity. This is gonna be awesome, trust me. Oh, I am too stressed. Um... We've never played together before, and... Uh, anyway... Sorry if this sucks. Fuck it. Yeah, let's go with it. Come on. Very nice, Alex. Very nice. And you too, Steph, of course. Yes. Oh, Charlotte. She's still angry. Oh, are you sure you want to do this? Maybe she's better now. We will see. I was horrible to you earlier. You really weren't. Really. Then I fucked up because I was trying pretty hard to be horrible to you. <laughs> <laughs> I was so excited about you coming to Haven. In my mind, the way I built it up, we were gonna be best friends. <laughs> I wish... What? There's still time. Maybe. I guess we'll see. Hey. You okay? No. But... Well, you know. I'm gonna go home. Uh, 
Tom meet me on the rooftop? Who? Oh, Steph. Sure thing. Meet Steph on the Sounds rooftop. Sounds like Steph wants to meet me on the rooftop. Oh, what, should I clean this? <laughs> I'm not working today. I think. Good that we take care of those plants, right, uh, before. You said you have some news? I'm leaving. I'm actually leaving Haven Springs. Can you believe it? Back on the road again. Fucking finally. Wait, seriously? I'm gonna play music again, Alex. Anywhere I want. God, I forgot how fucking good it feels. <sighs> yeah, so happy for you. Holy shit, Steph, that's so cool. I'm really happy for you. You better keep in touch. You think it's that easy to get rid of me? Come on, Chen. I need a new destination. <sighs> You're my good luck charm. You have shit taste in good luck charms. <laughs> Shut up. Pick one. Oh. And you will go there? Berlin, Salem, or Ocean? Uh, I will go for an ocean yeah let's go wow nice pick all right tell me about my life in the middle of the sea congratulations on your new gig playing drums in a cruise ship band i can make that work i'll mix up the dad rock and show tunes with one bikini kill cover per <laughs> set nudge some yuppies toward better taste <sighs> You could even throw in some originals. Before you know it, you've got the world's first cruise corps band. That sounds like a pretty spectacular plan. Great. Then come with me. What? To the ocean? <laughs> sure, why not? Doesn't have to be our first stop, but one day. I still have friends in Seattle who book shows. Maybe we start there or I don't know, Kansas City, Vegas, wherever we want. Why me? Look, I don't want to pressure you. But I've seen you give so much of yourself to make sure other people get what they need. And I guess I wonder if you've thought about what you need. I mean, obviously, I like you a lot, Alex. You mean the fucking world to me. Oh shit. Uh, what should I do? Let's hug her, right? I mean, I don't know. Damn. Oh, let's kiss her. Whatever. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. <laughs> yeah, that was a good choice then. Powerful. Jesus Christ. Look at the sky now. Shit. You don't have to decide anything now. 
okay? <laughs> Just think about it. I will. Thank you. I'm gonna head back down. Find me later. I will. gotta do something about that evidence that we have it's about time to do that right oh Alex speak of the devil do you have the USB drive I do it's all here Gabe's call, their secret plan, the cover-up. You need to come with me to the station. Alex? It's not a joke. Don't make this hard. Oh shit, what the hell? They have him in their pockets. Yeah, they have a lot of people, I guess, from this town. They are too powerful, this company. Oh boy. Probably isn't how you pictured your first spring festival, huh? Not exactly. Coffee? Um, yeah, well, uh, <laughs> a beer? Yeah, coffee could be great. Coffee would be great. Thanks. I don't know why I offered. We're actually out. <laughs> Come on, what? Stupid. Hike, <laughs> why am I here? Stupid. The long and short of it is, Diane is charging you with stealing her USB drive. Ah, uh, what? What the hell are you talking about? Did about you steal this. this USB drive or not? At least tell me you looked at it. I can't. Sorry. All right. Why not? What do you mean? Why not? Well, one, I would need a warrant. And two, the case is closed. What? The order came down today. I did what I could, but, you know, the evidence just wasn't there. Sorry, Alex. And the evidence is right here. Oh, my God. Yeah, but that's true. He need uh, a warrant for that. Uh... The order came down today from who? High up. Bosses, bosses, boss. It's not my job to know. Look, what happened to my brother wasn't an accident. It was criminal. The files on that drive prove it. That could be true. But let's say it is. The issue is you stole Typhon's property. I can't work with that. Yes, with the stolen item. Yeah, that's true. Okay, I get the point. I'm sorry I stole the drive, but... Apologizing isn't enough. Alex, you're not thinking about this clearly. Seems pretty clear to me. Diane wants to charge you with computer fraud. That's a federal crime, Alex. 
Five to ten, easy. Oh shit. And what now? You're telling me I might go to prison for this? For five to ten years? But there is a way, right? It's not that bad. Hey, I talked to her. And despite how angry she is at everything you did, she's willing to let it go. Just like that? I don't think so. If you agree to drop everything, Typhon won't press any charges. Whoa, okay. Doesn't this mean she's guilty? Yeah. She's only offering that deal because she knows I have her. She's guilty, Pike. Even if you're right, your only evidence is inadmissible. I think you should do it. Yeah, I think we Fuck are that. in a very bad I'm not situation. Oh. Alex. No. Typhon buried something in the mountains. Something so massive, they ignored Gabe's call and set off the blast just to cover it up. Don't you want to know what it is? What do you mean, cover it up? Another blast, unannounced, set off at the exact same time at the old mining site. And all of it happened just a few weeks before inspections were set to begin. Come on, Pike. It's all right here. Like I said, it doesn't matter. Alex, please, just sign the form, and we can both go back to the party. No. Alex, this is not an offer that you can choose. I said no. No is not an option. She's scared. Oh, uh, he's scared, yeah. What are you so scared of? See for yourself. What? Shit. What could be in that envelope? What is that? Typhon Mining Security. God damn. Alex Chan. Yeah, about me. <gasps> oh shit. About Ryan. And about Steph. So it's not only about me, it's about them as well. God Is this damn a threat? it. What did you expect? Huh? The Typhon, a global organization with billions in revenue, an army of lawyers, and who knows how many politicians in their pockets would just what, throw up their hands and say, You got us. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, get justice. I thought I could get justice for Gabe. Yeah, well, Typhon has their own idea of justice. Shit. Unfortunately, that's how it is. Yeah. Believe me, I want nothing more than to make these fuckers pay. I've learned the hard way that it's not possible they're too big too connected too ruthless you can hate me if you want call me a coward but i don't want to lose you like we lost gabe pike is terrified of typhon i bet if i took his fear away but it's not just about me steph and ryan are in danger too I want to hurt Typhon so bad, but can I really put their lives at risk along with mine? No, I don't think we can do that, right? This is too much. If it was just about me... Uh, no, sign Typhon's affidavit. Yes, let's do that. All I have to do is sign? Yeah. <clears throat> 
Next marks the spot. Can't turn back now. Time to sign my soul away. Fuck me. Damn it. Yeah, unfortunately that's how it is. We stole one and only evidence. <laughs> yeah. We have no choice. We gotta do this. Oh, what a relief. Thank you, Alex. You did the right thing. Ah, oh, well, we will see. This is bigger than it seems to be. And what they are hiding there in this mine. Yeah, I'm wondering about that. Well, there is just one last... Uh, this is like the last part of this chapter, I guess, already. Come see me when you get the chance, Jed. Alright. Well... You're somewhere over here. Downstairs in the bar, bar or at the festival? Uh, yeah, and there is only one I more can't chapter. Believe this. I had them. How did it go so wrong? Oh. I have no idea what to do next. Maybe talking to Jed will help me feel better. How would it not go wrong? With a stolen evidence? First, I need to get out of this dress. Get out of this dress? Why? You look all right. Whoa. Well, <laughs> I don't know nothing about that. I know nothing about that. Postcards. I guess the night wasn't all bad. Oh, those postcards, yes. From staff. Let's dress then. Let's see. What can we wear? Might as well go talk to Jed now. What? Come on, what was that? Oh, we couldn't pick anything. I just... Yeah, she just took whatever there was. <laughs> if you are feeling comfortable in this, then let's go. I feel... Oh, yeah, I feel something as well, but... There's no time for that. What's hey, Jed. up, Jed? There she is. Have a seat. Something tells me you've had a more exciting spring festival than you planned for. You saw Pike arrest me. And let you go, apparently. Then there's that business with Ryan and Steph earlier today I wasn't sure why it took all three of you to work out Diane's lunch order <laughs> it was a big order that's why I know you're used to looking out for yourself Gabe was like that but Haven's a community we help each other I want to help you but first you have to let me know what's going on. Fuck it. What have I got to lose? Everything? Uh, yeah. Typhon uh, killed Gabe. Typhon killed Gabe. I have proof. What proof? I stole it from Diane. Emails and documents proving there was a second explosion the night Gabe died. To cover something up, Jed. Some secret they buried. 
I don't know what it is. I don't even know what to do next. But I'm not giving up. Not ever. I know what they're hiding. What? You knew? Wait. You're telling me you knew that Typhon's crooked? This whole time? Typhon's the devil that runs this town. I've been carrying their secrets for far too long. Oh. I know what they buried in the mountains. Tell me. I'll do one better. I'll show, show you. you. Yeah. There, up ahead. Where are we? Middle of nowhere. About two clicks that way is the mining site where you search for Ethan. Five clicks that way is town. What is this thing? Ventilation shaft. They're scattered everywhere. Over the years, mines grow into mines, creating a labyrinth under Haven. What you're searching for is down below. Which is what? Oh my god, what is he picking? He was moving his hand behind. Chad. Why are you sad? Oh shit, what? I'm sorry, kid. You gotta be kidding me. Jed. What are you doing? I tried to talk you out of it. Scare you off. I was sure those pictures of Ryan and Steph would do the trick. But you were relentless. Won't leave damn well enough alone. You don't have to do this. I do. Twelve years ago. I made a mistake. The kind of thing that you... you can't undo. But Typhon made me a deal. A way to save my town. Give my boy a normal life. I never wanted Gabe to get hurt. Go to hell. But that was a really f short chapter. Thank you guys for staying with me. I hope you liked it and enjoyed it. If you did, leave some like or comment. I will appreciate that very much. And I will see you soon in another episode from uh, Life is Strange Through Colors.